Tyler Glass now leads the majors in strikeouts. He's third of the National League and wins and tonight tries to go to seven and two. The production is that of an ace. He is coming off a bumpy outing in his last one. But you know what? I am always excited to watch this young man pitch. 2-2 comes home. It's a breaking ball. It's rolled the first race to the bag. Not an easy one to win, but with strides of that length makes it a little bit easier. Well, here comes Cattell Marte bringing with him a 20 game hitting streak. Cattell Marte oh, wow. make it a lucky 21. It bounces into right center. I mean, he's just automatic candy. He shoots it right into the right center gap, and he's got himself a one out single. Arizona has its first base runner. Here comes Jack Peterson. Hits this one hard in the air to center field. Got under it a little bit, and Pajes will put it away. Two out. Christian Walker, who, like Jock Peterson, hit a home run last night and kicks and comes home. A head start for Marte, and that is high in the air left field. Not deep. Teoscar Hernandez waiting for it to come down, and finally had a parachute on it. Drops into the glove for out number three. And for the second time of the series, Diamondbacks will go with a lefty reliever as an opener to start the game. Monday it was Joe Mantiply. Tonight it's Brandon Hughes, who's up today from AAA Reno. Loki gets into this one, drives it deep to center. Corbin Carroll to the wall, and Corbin Carroll reels it in. You talk about a loud out number one. That was it. So Hughes gets to face Otani with the bases empty. Throws the first one, and Otani smacks a base hit the other way. Hustling out of the box. He will throw on the brakes with a long single. That's the Ichiro club right there that he's added to the bag this year. Uses 1-0, swung on, and that's popped up to third. It's playable for Suarez as he wanders into foul territory, makes the catch. And here is the right-hander Ryan Nelson working in relief for the first time this year after making seven starts. 1-2, and a high check swing strike. Yes, he did on appeal. The inning is over. So Nelson strikes out the only batter he faces. The Dodgers strand one. So one on base runner for Arizona. Suarez last night had two hits. Swing and a miss. First strikeout for Tyler Glass now. Two out. Catcher Moreno with two away. Glass now fires. And he did go. Moreno tried to hold up but could not. Back to back punch outs for Tyler Glass now. Caps off the second inning. And now here is Jason Hayward hitting just 208 with a homer and four RBIs. Oh, two runner goes. The pitch swung on and missed. And that'll do it for the Dodgers in the bottom of the second. They get a leadoff walk, but Nelson recovers. A leadoff batter aboard for the D-backs. Lineup will turn over for Corbin Carroll. Carroll down on a high fastball. Glass now put it right where the lead tries to against Carroll. Take it his third K. One on one out. Cattell Marte has already extended his hitting streak to a career bash 21 games. 97 sneaks by Marte. Hard guy to do that against. Fourth K for Glass now. Here's Jock Peterson. One on, two out. He struck out four of the last five he's faced on 3-2. That's another one. Will Smith will touch Peterson just to make it official and a ball in the dirt. Back to the top in bets, although since they used the opener, this would be the first chance for these guys to see Nelson. And Mookie hits a ball to left field that is hooking down toward the warning track. It one hops off the wall. Guriel picks it up and throws it back in, but Betts is standing on second base with a one-out double. And what you do not want is a runner in scoring position for Otani. He had a base hit against Hughes's first time up. Swung on and grounded to second. Backhanded by Marte. And he will throw to first for the out. Betts gets to third. And with two down, it brings up Freddie Freeman. Here's the pitch. Swung on. And that's lifted out to right field. Grichik there. Camped underneath it. Makes the catch. And the inning is over. So Nelson works around the one-out double. Glass now has struck out five Diamondbacks in his first three innings. Stuck with a fastball. Got a pop fly down the line. Here comes Hayward. Still coming into foul ground. Not an easy play, but he makes it. And then falls into the net with a smile on his face. As long as it doesn't graze the netting, that's the tough call for the umpire. But it was a fun catch for Jason Hayward. The wry smile at the end to his teammates, especially Freddie Freeman. One down in the fourth inning. Lourdes Gurriel back to the plate for Arizona. And it works. Six strikeout for Tyler Glass now. While we have talked about and praised Tyler Glass now for being a strikeout master, leading all of baseball entering tonight. 
you wondered how it was going to be against an Arizona team that is really good in the strikeout department. But Tyler Glasnow has already punched six tickets. Glasnow fires, and it's a ground ball to Mookie Betts at short. This throw is a good one. A 1 2 3 fourth inning for Tyler Glasnow. Another donut on the board for the D backs. Diamondbacks are going to bring the infield in. Here in the fourth inning. Looking for a strikeout. Got him. Ryan Nelson, straight heat. He went right after him with aggressive fastballs. Picks up his fourth strikeout. And this would be an enormous boost for Ryan Nelson if he can get Jason Hayward here. Infield backs up now with two outs. The pitch swung on, grounded to first. Walker on a knee, picks it up and takes it to the bag himself. And Nelson works out of a second and third jam. The Dodgers do not score. First walk issued by Tyler Glass now. There's your base runner. Uh, you got Newman coming up who's been swinging a hot bat. Another base hit for Kevin Newman. Moreno takes the turn. He heads for third. Paez throws into third and it gets away. Newman's into second. Aggressive Diamondback base running. Boy, Kevin Newman has become unstoppable. Second and third, one out. The Dodgers were just in this situation. Let's see what the Diamondbacks can do. Second and third, one down. Corbin is 0 for 2. Corbin Carroll sends it to right center. That drops in and gets to the wall. Moreno's home. Newman coming home. Corbin Carroll heads for third with a two-run triple. And it's 2-0 Diamondbacks. That's more like it. Another extra base hit for Corbin Carroll. That's four in his last five games. The infield must remain in against Marte. And kicks away. Here comes Corbin, and it's three zip Diamondbacks. Last now spiked a curveball, and it went off the shin guard, it sounded like a Will Smith. One out, and the Dodgers now have runners at first and third. Well, now you deal with Freddie Freeman. Ryan Nelson, the fist pump at 96. He gets a fastball by Freeman. Moreno hangs on, and there are two outs in the fifth. Now here's the catcher, Will Smith. Don't sleep on him either. A very dangerous right-handed hitter. Swung on and belted. Out to right field. Gritchick going back, and on the warning track makes the catch. The inning is over. The Dodgers with first and second, nobody out, do not score. Tyler Glasnow's night is over. It's Christian Walker to lead off the sixth since 2019. He has hit a whole bunch of home runs against the boys in blue. Go ball. Christian Walker, there's another Dodger Stadium home run for Christian Walker. And the Diamondbacks have opened up a 4-0 lead. That is his 14th career home run in this ballpark. And here come the Dodgers. Well, the batter is going to be Andy Pajes, who is 0 for 2 against Nelson. Up the middle, Marte for one. Oh, Trying yeah. to get two. Oh, Moreno with the glove and the tags. Nice. We could tell right away, signal to everybody. We're going to try and get as many as we can here. Watch Marte up the middle right there. Now how about Gabby Bob yeah, running down that. there? Well, Ryan Nelson, with the help of Cattell Marte and company, gets two outs in the sixth inning, and that will be it. Here comes Tori Lovello. Pretty deep left center. Corbin Carroll, Lourdes Gurriel Jr. Lourdes has got into the warning track. And it comes to an end. We go to the top of the eighth inning. Cattell Marte leads off for the Diamondbacks. Cattell turns on that one down the line, and it's hit off the pole for a home run. Cattell Marte, that's his tenth. Boy, that was on an absolute rope. 110 off the bat, clanged off the foul pole. Make it 5 nothing Diamondbacks. And now the third baseman, Suarez. That goes off the glove of Smith. Walker's coming in to make it 6 0. And Guriella moves into second. Will be kicking himself on that one. He just flat out misses it. And now the Dodgers down to their final out. Hayward is last man standing for the Dodgers. Kevin Newman has it at shortstop. And the Diamondbacks have a 6 0 win. Their first Dodger Stadium shutout since September of 2017. And their first series win in this ballpark since April of 2018.